Okay. Wow. This is just amazing what I found a few days ago at a thrift store. It was only for free. Didn't have to pay any money. This machine does not record onto tapes. This is a playback only unit. This one has only one speed, which is 15th, 16th inches per second. Half the regular 1 and 7 8 speed of the cassette tape format. So this runs at half the regular t speed of cassette. This is made for talking book cassettes. This is made to be operated by the blind. As a matter of fact, this is of the Library of Congress and property of the U.S. government. You can see no, National Library Service for the Blind and Physically Handicapped. The Library of Congress, Model E1. This is actually um, manufactured for the Library of Congress by Telex. On the other side, it's it's double insulated, so this thing is very this is very durably built. I I took the bottom off one time just to see how it is inside, and the whole thing is a big circuit board, all these chips everywhere and stuff. It's and it's the metal, the transport metal is very thick and sturdy. See, look there, property of U.S. government. Oh man, isn't that something? Anyway. Um, luckily, I have this SuperScope C202LP cassette recorder, which is a two-speed unit. It has the standard 1 and 7 eighths and the 15 16 speed. So with this SuperScope, I was able to record at the right speed to play back right on this machine. So I'll play a little tape here that I recorded of, of one of my friends um, saying on the end of the tape. How I operate this thing to play. Meet some classic people. Come in and meet my good friends. Meet Jim Quadre. Meet Mr. Mitchell. Meet Papa. Meet tongue sticking out and race. Meet a nice teacher, Professor Ugly Eyes. Meet two singers, Johnny and Jimmy Geesh. Johnny Geesh sings in the classic band, the deformities. Jimmy Geesh sings in another band called Geeshification. All these people, except race, came from a country called the We A We A Freak. Maybe someday you can get to be in a class taught by Professor Ugly Eyes. Ugly Eyes. I guarantee you will like him as a teacher. Oh, and did you know that Mr. Mitchell is 109 years old? And Johnny and Jimmy Geesh use reel-to-reel -reel tape for their band recordings. They know the good quality it has. Race's race car has an 8-track player in it. Bye and thank you for listening. Um, that was my friend was reading from something that I typed. Um, and I had him read it. Right. Look how the tape loads there, I mean. The wheel Now, we the talking book cassettes are recorded in a four track form. This side will switch tracks. This is only half track, but I can play it in reverse and never do this enough. Maybe someday you can get... That means track two. Press it again, hold it. Track three, and... Track four. This is reverse. Backwards. <laughs>
Nab, South Benazinus, she in ice. To handle. She name is not in ice. To headphones. Yeah, you got Rosafa. Rosis Chan Nadim. Sierra, I get snus. The tongue sticking out and race. And also, you can hear how it sounds. Have music played on it as music recorded off the radio with a super scope at that speed. Has a good full sound out of that speaker. I guess this pauses it when you do it just a little bit. Of course, whenever you play um, a regular speed recording on this, you know, made at one seven eights. It comes out slow. Like an auto reverse. I like those beat sounds, the classic thing. Very cool, isn't it? Interesting to have this thing, property of the U.S. government. This thing is very heavy too, and it's just it's built it's built like a battle tank. And then, by the way, I got a din jack finally for my Bang Bangin Alufsen cassette deck, and I was able to record on it. I recorded a whole tape of a whole bunch of songs with this thing. I just it was on a chrome tape, and let me tell you. This Bayo Cord 8000 is one high quality tape deck. Amazing quality. Well, I'll be making a video of a system over there after this. Bye.